He's on your block with a whale of the good stuff. No better solution to the zombie problem than a set of silver arrows. Pay the big cheese on your block with a whale of the good stuff. Heavenly herring, delicious dogfish, yours for a scrap of dog meat. The trial of ascension is behind us. Do you feel quite ascended? An interesting moment of reflection in the midst of our journey, indeed.
body is still and cold. One of the Guardians will want to see this. Xandalor! Is he... dead? Guardians! The last of the portals at the end of time has reignited. You must have found the final... Xandalor! But what is... Leandra. She was here, wasn't she? But there's no time. Stand back, Guardians! Xandalor is unconscious, but a pulse of life beats within him still. I must heal him before it's too late. What... what did... Leandra... she's here somewhere. She... Ikara. As ever, Xandalor. Are you alright? I'm better than I've any right to be, thanks to you. She was just here, Ikara. She must have brought her death knights through the portal and then destroyed it behind her. I thought I could defend it, but she... She isn't herself. She's become something... something I can hardly comprehend. She needs our help, Xandalor, and the Guardians need every moment they can get if they're to find her. The... the Guardians? By heavens. Can it be? Then the myths are true. But my amulet... The Star Stone. That must mean the protectors of the God Box are real. They have returned. The Slayers of the Void. How can it be that you've raised yourselves from lost spirits to saviors? Here you are, standing before your ancestral home once more, while I've only managed to get myself knocked on the flat of my back again. Anything I can do to help you, Guardians, you must ask of me. If I can provide even a modicum of assistance to you, my purpose will have been fulfilled. I am the last of my kind, a keeper of the source, keeper of its memory, of its most ancient secrets. Some of the earliest devotees of source created certain sacred documents, one of which fell into Leandra's hands. That could preserve the memory of that power, come what may. To most, the tales were little more than myth, but to a knowing eye, they contained the most important details of our past. As the Keeper of the Source, it was my responsibility to protect these secrets, including the secret of this portal. But Leandra has stayed one step ahead of me at every turn. Leandra attacked me. Once she'd located the rune of the Forest Spirit, she and her Death Knight stormed this place with little ceremony. The portal behind me led to the First Garden, that realm of the gods where you once dwelled, and that I have been sworn to protect. Now that she's leapt through, my gravest fears are one step closer to reality. I believe that Leandra intends to use her army to wage war against Astarte and free the Void, and that she is well on her way to doing just that. But here you are, the Guardians. A fantasy turned to fact, and so I hope salvation. How remarkable. How utterly remarkable. You must be here to finish what you began so many millennia ago. You must be here to cage the Void once and for all. You yourselves must enter the First Garden. You must face Leandra. And if we are too late, the Void Dragon. You have slain it once before, Guardians. You will succeed again. Leandra has destroyed this portal. But your work restoring your threads to the Tapestry of Time has sparked the Homestead's last shrine. A portal that could only have been remembered by the Guardians themselves. The Tapestry of Time? It's a long story, Xandalor. You'll see soon enough. We will accompany you, Guardian. But know that I cannot give up on Leandra just yet. I cannot believe my own sister incapable of redemption. Who else but the Guardians of the God Box could defeat the Void Dragon? Who but its first defeaters could encase it once and for all? The souls that reside within you are more noble, more dear than any who have or ever will live. Only those souls have ever subdued the dragon. Only they will subdue it once more. As you wish, Guardians. When you are ready, we will enter the first garden together. With you return to us at last, I dare hope we may end this madness yet.
Yet again, Leandra disabled Zandalore, but did not kill him. Perhaps there's hope she may be redeemed. And that seed might well be the key that ends this madness. Friends, your labors have borne essential fruit. Fruit that will save us all. The final portal is opened. The portal to the first garden. Leandra and the Trife are so very close to bringing the dragon back to bear upon Rivalon. But you are so very close to stopping them. This way, the destiny of time itself awaits. Ica, listen. About Leandra. About that night. No, Zandalor. Not now. But before we go through, before we see her again, I want you to... Enough. The Guardians need us. There's no time for this. Susanna, at your service. Through this portal, never again may you, Divine Ones, return to our realm. Your future lies only forward, and space and time will bend to keep you there. What lies beyond is a world unseen for an eon by human eyes, where you once dwelled as immortals where Astarte and Source itself were born. Leandra has infiltrated. She is poised to summon the Void, to overwhelm Astarte with her army of Death Knights. But the side of light, of creation, of existence itself has something she'll never have. You. Ikara and I will not leave your side. We will go where you lead us. Your fate awaits, dear Guardians and with it the fate of all Rivalon. So I suppose only one little question remains. Are you ready? Beyond here lies the true end of time, and it is our fate to stop it. Yet Zigzag's question rings heavy in my ears. I'm not sure. Perhaps we've still- As you wish. Our fate Once you step so... Beyond here lies the... Tr May the void tremble... My friends, before you leap into eternity, know this. I have seen planets born and races die, empires rise and spirits fall. But this, time rewoven, heroes returned from oblivion, You've granted me the greatest tale yet told. And remember, Zigzags will never forget. This cannot be the first garden. Something must Why have gotten you stop fighting. Guardians are your cards. Fear is your only god. What's this ice 
spy with my big little eye. It skitters like vermin, confused and afraid. Answer me! What do I spy? Pathetic! You know the answer, but you dare to speak it! rather unpleasant. I wonder what's next. Leandra, this place where feels are you? eerily familiar. Back to the end of our beginnings. Please, sister. Please come back. I'm sorry. Just look at you. My treasure, look at all your Is that you? Have you seen Leandra? She's run off. Which of their failures will be forced to honor next? I'd recognize that barkeep. Spells trouble. All he's done so far Have you seen my sister? I'll be on my guard. Leandra, please, this has gone on long enough. What do you think it will be like in the void, Sir Irtha? From nothing, returned to nothing. It'll be like... Ooh, careful there, hunters. Are you sure you want to descend even deeper? That is one hefty tome over there. One I daren't read, not in this place.
Such a thing as why? Not until Leandra has been drained of hers. Wander, hunter. Exhaust yourself. All you have left is but a dream within a dream. Looks like the doctors have become the patients. Role reversal and poetic justice tend to go hand in hand. Such anguish! Good gods! The odor in here is sickening. Makes my eyes water and my throat burn! from her, sticky fingers. <laughs> she is mine, and mine alone. Such a I won't anguish. let the nasties hurt you, my...
not, fear not. One more amputation and you'll be right as rain. No. It was nothing. It was supposed to be nothing. I am here. But where is my wife? Not a more yeah, the branches range yes. lie as all. Well. Is this all there is? No, boy. Well, it's well. Oh, all wet. Not to worry. Not to worry. The animal. and you'll be right as rain. Place. But me, it just reminds of a night out with a lad. We will hold a special vigil. We will pray. No Madara's got your back. No matter what may come, may the fire. Astarte rests in death's embrace. Pray for her while your prayers are for naught. Her soul. Yes, forever. We will hold an eternal vigil. We will pray for the goddess for a hot Such heartbreak! Return to us, Astarte! Wake from the dead, please! Sweet relief! Such heartbreak! Wake from the dead! Oh, the star is dead! Oh, the young is dead! May not even eternity amaze them! Say no more! Betray the world! I weep for you, my goddess! With you has died the hopeless of us! Oh, such woe! Such heartbreak! Dead as stuff. 
Look upon the dead Astarte and smile or weep as you see. From the dead, we will hold an eternal vigil. We will pray for the goddess forever. Forever. We will pray for the goddess forever.